with the cylinder we just created, the next step is to cut a thread on the cylinder. So we use this command, it's called helical cutout, to cut a thread on the cylinder. Just click on the command, select this plane. Then we can see the side view of the cylinder. Here, we use the line command to draw line start from the corner horizontal enter 1.5 millimeter press return key and click on your mouse key you can use the control plus shift key and the plus right mouse key to shift the things around you can use the Control part, right mouse button key to zoom in and out, just your view. So this is the control part, right mouse button key. All right. Uh, the second line is 1.5. Again, press return. The angle is 120. Press return and move to the first line and move around until this end point indicator appears, click. So we have this triangle. All right. So we have this triangle. We can cut this one all the way through to this implant. We need to draw another lines across from one side. It can be longer than this implant to this side. So this uh, right click and cancel the line command. Then we can choose this excess of revolution to assign this line which is drawn as an excess of revolution. Now we can click the close sketch when kick back to 3D view. In this 3D view we need to specify the starting point of the uh, cutting. Then we need to specify the um, pitch as 1.6 press enter then you click on preview you'll see this tube is cut with a thread so that's it for this step so click on finish and so and then save it again and then we move to the next step it's that's it for this video